Legal professionals are sounding the alarm about the use of artificial intelligence in the justice system. New AI transcription service companies want to replace court reporters, but experts say doing so could present major security and accuracy issues in legal proceedings. Two News reporter Elias Seabrooks joins us live in the studio after asking experts about why courts should be cautious about this technology. That's right, Brooke and John. The National Court Reporters Association released this report highlighting ethical and legal concerns regarding the use of AI technology in courtrooms and its apparent threat to the legal system. These are very important matters that need precision. People's liberty and freedom is on the line. Court reporters create records from what happens in legal proceedings. These original documents can be referenced from civil trials all the way to the Supreme Court. So ensuring their accuracy is vital. Now that process could soon be changing with the introduction of digital transcription software that uses AI. Research suggests that the voice recognition technology is less accurate when transcribing for speakers of color. But Dr. Robert McDowell, the director for the Center for Teaching and Learning at Cedarville University, says it's not an issue of race, but of dialect. Without a proper sample of all dialects spoken in the U.S., the voice recognition software is likely to mistake some words for others at this stage of development. I don't know if we're at the stage where you could just completely remove someone, especially when you're talking about court proceedings. Professionals say it all comes down to accountability. This would be almost impossible with the outsourcing of AI technology. Experts are concerned because these processes often have little to no oversight for accuracy. Technology that stores that information um, with no oversight um, is very dangerous. Inaccurate court reporting could also lead to a higher rate of appeals and retried cases. Defense and prosecuting attorneys frequently reference these certified transcribed documents in court, but automation bias can include omitted or added words that could alter actual testimony. It would be jeopardizing justice. Um, the courts are already very backed up, and if we have to start recreating records, um, that's going to be problematic. Anderson says the National Court Reporters Association is working on a bill to have these concerns addressed. This bill is in the early stages, but has already been presented to state leaders in Washington, D.C. Live in studio, Aaliyah Seabrooks, 2 News.